All right, so hopefully this don't be too bad. I got Tommy Hearns. He picked Sugar Ray Leonard. It's the 146 version, though. Niggas always pick. Teddy Atlas. Right, niggas always pick. You to the Metro Manila Arena here in the Philippines for tonight's main event. I probably should have got uh, a tune-up game, man. Well, it'll get to know you here in the opening round scheduled for 10. Move! Oh, this is how we playing? This is how we playing? Right. Should be sit right here. Sit right here, nigga. Here in this about. Fight because no doubt about it, Ray has a target on him, and he's got a power puncher standing opposite him. Yeah, but no, that's what the good thing Finish about the being Sugar Finish Ray Leonard is. Because he's so solid in so many that's areas. Not what I he's technically solid. And you know what that that's is? my main issue with this that's game. The if you doing shit, I don't so press you. So he's going to find a way. That shit fuck around. Get me knocked out one day. Bomb. He knows how to technically, how to physically... How to defensively get rid of that power. Good block by his sugar. How the fuck did that hit me? That's okay, that's okay. Let it Are you kidding me, dog? That's not what I pressed. Leonard's not just He's supposed to start up. step. He's what the fuck, my nigga? Like he did right there. I wanted to pick uh De La Hoya, but I didn't want to leave this nigga waiting either. But you never know who these people are gonna pick, yo. So you gotta be careful. I don't think he's throwing like high, too high. The fuck? This nigga didn't even do it. You ass, bro. A combination here. That's what he does. How am I missing him? Very best. Why are you across the damn ring? Nothing there on the punch by Tommy Hearns. Fuck out of here. Well played, straight right hand. Oh, they both land flush with uppercuts. How? How, my nigga? A headshot block. Tommy Hearns is the kind of boxer that wants to do just that. Find the target, get the combination working, land both punches. This round comes to an end. And Teddy, easy to note here that he wasn't landing a lot of punches. Now he was throwing them up, but he wasn't landing a lot. Is that because of his opponent's defense, or is he just not that accurate of a puncher? No, it's a combination. First of all, his opponent is pretty slick in there, pretty good at bobbing, weaving a little bit, slipping a little bit, making himself a difficult target, but his punch is a little wide. Let's see how this should play out. He needs to shorten him up. I actually do have training tonight. Nice this is our fucking time. goal. I want to go. Well targeted one two. That, that's not what the fuck I Be trying to cut the ring off properly. It's hard as shit to do that anyway. That's not oh my gosh, man. I'm trying to size up. This nigga weave and shit. Parries that nigga step all the way across the ring and shit. Leonard's proving to be elusive. I wish it. I wish I knew how to faint. It's like you you flick the stick and hold press R or some shit. But it, I I don't know. I, I would have to. Um... That is a big right hand after eating one himself. Halfway through this round here. Um... You know it's a new day and age, but people should really reflect on the celebrity of Sugar Ray Leonard. There was a long time period in this. Yeah, I ain't used to give uh, Ray Leonard no props, no love. When I was uh, an all mainstream pop culture. I mean, I guess you could say younger. Well, he had that great smile. He was doing endorsements. Being a few years ago. Soda commercials, you know. And I think what's interesting. Like, but I went back and looked at this nigga fights. Bro, this nigga is nice. That nigga used to throw combinations fast as fuck, and they used to be powerful. And he had all this great. You look at that shit. That nigga was dropping bombs. Fast as shit. That shit was hard. Like looking at him fight the ran and shit. That he could be just a regular guy. A guy that you could count on. Bunch of adversity with fighting. Nigga, what the fuck happened? They said his retina was detached and shit. That's crazy. Blocks that punch. Nigga so damn tall, the shit hit me anyways. Hearns is going with a quality that I think is very underrated in boxing. That is Roy Jones Jr., legendary. When, how, and make the most of each thing you're doing. I mean, 
my f my favorite fighter. Okay, so I guess Roy Jones would be my favorite fighter. Uh, but who I feel is though it was the best. Is Floyd. Mike Tyson was great. I don't. I'm not even gonna say that. I'm not. I'm, I'm gonna just leave that that thought to myself. A guy that understands his true science. Like, I'm paying attention while I'm talking, but I'm kind of, like, in a zone where I'm not paying attention. It's kind of weird. And now he's that was ass. Like a I wish I could faint. The right hand after getting scored upon. Damn, my nigga do what I press. Good block by Tommy Hearns. Pussy. Uh, sending more than one at him now. That nigga stopped my combo. Oh, Dismisses his opponent's headshot. Coming to the halfway point Keep. of this third round. Keep. Keep. I'm pressing shit, but he not doing it. Wait, who blood is that? Mine, yo? Accurate counter punch by Sugar Ray Leonard. I know this fight gonna be boring as fuck. That is exactly what the corner wanted to see. A good combination punch by Tommy Hearns. I'm surprised he ain't, uh... See, he's got his guard up really well that time. Fuck, I didn't. His head. My, my man's got to get his uh, hands back to his face faster than that. Pussy. He's showing what a That's skilled wrong, fighter he is with the counter punching. Well, the old times used to say when you're calm in there, when you're controlling there, you can make him do what you want. He what the fuck are you running for, y'all? Yeah? Like you liking my leg position? Just I couldn't throw no counter. Seconds to go in this round. <laughs> Smart uppercut by Sugar Ray Leonard. Y'all niggas be ass, bro. And the round comes to an end. I hate looking at this shit. This fight? Niggas this dancing. Man, you got it. If you want this fight, you got it. Burns is up around here after three rounds on Teddy's scorecard, but really nobody has distinguished themselves to any great amount. Come here, bitch. Fuck is you talking about? Unable to score with the hook. Sugar Ray you don't, you don't want to stand here. Is it ever on, good? This, Look at how easy Niggas had the same idea. Tommy Hearns is in a good rhythm defensively here. Teddy, what is that? A credit to his ability to anticipate? You know, also, it's the teaching. Let's give the trainers credit. Of course, let's give his background of the amateurs That's not. I don't want to step in with my jab like that. I feel like it really How to get away from punches. This is technique that was taught to him. No. <sighs> Y'all niggas see that uh, shit with, um... Tank and Devin Haney. Oh, that's good stuff. I don't know if I told the story before, but that nigga Tank tried to. I don't think I told him on my channel, but I told a few people. That nigga Tank tried to take my head. Ninety and seconds to go shit. here in this round. And you see, he turned defense into offense. Comes back with the counter punch. And that's exactly what he brings to the game. I seen that nigga do some uh, makes you pay. wild shit. And my nigga, he makes you think twice. what are you doing? He's throwing a punch later on. We used to go to uh, the same school, Digital Hub in Baltimore, and I don't know what happened. I don't know if he had got locked up or something or what. He was just training. Maybe he was in camp for fighting or something. Just like that. Just like that. But the nigga, uh, at one point, he was like out of school for like a month or something. What the fuck do what I per... Right, Bitch, what the fuck are you talking about? Come here. A nice block by Sugar Ray Leonard. He got hit, but he bitch. sends it right back. Okay. Burns is doing a brilliant job. Well, all right. I think if I throw a jab out. They, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Right here, and it's frustrating his opponent. All right, but it is frustrating his opponent. Back opponent to the story. It, it was kind of hard to try to see it, looking at that shit he was doing. I had to pay attention. Um, not what's not there. We know that the head. What happened was, but what's there? Because he he asked me for the shit twice. I think I was coming back from lunch one day. Me and my man is having. We was heading back to the little fucking. What was it? History class, art class, some shit. On what was it? The second floor. Second floor, I think. With a left hand. And it was, it was a uh, stairway. It was two sets of stairs. This is gonna be hard as fuck to try to tell a story and pay attention to the game. Turn that hook yeah, this is gonna be hard. To a connect. 
It's like I I want to just back away and tell the story, but that shit. This is opponent shot, and then comes back with an uppercut. Well done. Like if I can pull a jab, like I want to, I want to pull a jab so I could counter. No, come. Gosh, bro. But the nigga, um, I'm walking up the steps and shit. To work here in round and number five. He was like, yo, let me get your head. Because I had a North Face head. I think it was, what, black and white? It was, nowhere near his opponent. It, was it was a Scully. Um, Teddy, is this becoming a mental thing with him? I, mean, I don't think I'm paying him, paying him attention, so I don't know if he's talking to me. You know, that's uh, a good question. Sometimes a guy is making a solid agreement. I think my man, my man's or somebody was like, yo, he talking to you or something. He won't hit me hard. Uh, I look at him. He's like, yo, let me get your head. Now to throw the punches. I, what happened? I think I said, I, I was like, nah. Come back at him. Fuck. Let me pay attention. Not a good sign. Good clean shot returning fire. Well done by Sugar Ray Leonard. And now he's targeting upstairs. Tommy Hearns is putting forth that hard work he did in training camp there, landing a crisp... Oh, uh, why the fuck did you run away? Yeah, like? Ten clicks of the talk. You just backing up and not doing nothing. I don't understand that shit. I really don't understand that shit, y'all. Now I'm late for... Now I'm not even really late to training. This, this guy that shit like 10 minutes away. It's 6, 19. Three or four punches in a row. I can't spend I can spend my energy, but I don't want to like fuck myself up and my damage is high. I'm not paying attention to tell a story. Nigga, uh, nice work on the outside. Nice work on the outside. So I'm like, nah, whatever. I keep walking up the stairs, head back to the class. And it was another time. He asked me he asked me that shit in my locker. And I was like, I ain't even looking at the nigga. I was just like, nah, I kept and I walked off. Not hitting his mark there going upstairs. That was bullshit. I wish I could replay that. Able to dismiss it. Tommy Hearns is doing something that not everybody appreciates, but he is making his bitch like what are you? Oh, yeah, well, gosh, a lot you know. of times people, you know, they only get it done on one end. What I mean about that is, you know, offensively they use the jab, they use aggression to set up the offense but he uses defense to set up the offense he he has a double-edged sword the fuck you leaning back for you left hook to the body then he comes you can't fuck me not what he was looking for that's a miss right there by tommy hearns no come on do what i press do what i press Dude, I first what the fuck? Oh my gosh. Bring your bald ass over here, bitch. Fuck you talking about. It's round six. I got the energy to spend too. I hate these niggas, y'all. Who up? Who up? Because they had me up one round, right? And when it was round three. Tommy Hearns with a huge Ooh, you lucky game. bitch. Off to the side, a little swing and a miss. Going Fuck that, I'm spending that shit. This has been a very entertaining fight. A little time to reflect here at the end of this round. My thoughts being this. I would really be surprised if we go to a decision here. It just has that kind of feel to it. Yeah, it has a feel to me like going to one of those places where you can eat all the pasta you can. 95. For one Look at that, John. And some guys get well, my damage still high eat shit. about five bowls. Well, these guys, they're going to have a stomach ache at the end. Somebody is going to wind up not standing at the end. Bruh. The hitman lands a left. Well one of the worst, Tommy one of the most racist things I've ever seen, like, pertaining to boxing, was that Floyd Mayweather versus Connor shit. Them live streams, them fucking comments, dog. That shit was the worst shit I've ever seen. He got hit right there. Like, that was the most racist shit I've ever seen with boxing. I don't even know where them fans was from. I, I can't even say they was fans. 
but they were saying dumb shit. I, I think I screenshotted like some of that shit. I don't remember. What Able they to block that exactly away. It was moment. targeted for his head. But that shit was crazy. I mean, I got the energy to spin, but this bitch ain't. Stay away from the inside, baby. Stay Gets rid of that. It was intended for his head. Wait, let me see. Oh. Leonard's doing a really good job of being defensively sound, of being patient, and waiting for that golden opportunity for some offense to come in the mix. Well, that's exactly what he's doing. He's waiting for a mistake to be made. You know, he wants a lead out of his opponent right now so he can make a miss and bang, come right back with that hook. What are you, Ali? You trying to do that fake ass overdo thing? No, fuck no, because I didn't throw a jab. I was trying to throw an uppercut. And a, a right uppercut at that, not no fucking. That she just threw. This shit ass, bro. This fucking video gonna be ass, man. Really good work right there, landing the two punches in sequence by Tommy Hearns. He's tired. He's tired, champ. But the way they was talking about kind of power, that shit had me thinking like, yo, I don't know if Floyd got this shit, dog. No, 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 not even that. It wasn't. I don't know if Floyd got it. It was like, Floyd gotta be careful, man. Maybe younger than him. Deep breath. Deep breath. I'm not trying to see my man go out like that. 49 and all. 50, baby. Wow, I still got all my my stamina is still in the 90s. So I know his. I mean, he just backing up the whole time. This guy. Keep your distance, all right? Keep my distance. I have to go to him because he's running the fuck away. Not protecting yourself out there. I'm not protecting. Somebody show me the fucking scorecards. Sugar Ray Leonard started to wrap this one. fight now. Look at Teddy's scorecard as we start round number eight. Okay. Was a close okay, fight, okay. but just... Do what I press, nigga, damn. ...his opponent as he extends this lead. Well, this is where you start to see the personality. Yeah. You know, where you start to have an x-ray, a portal into the soul of a guy. What he's made of, what his temperament is, the decisions he makes. He wants to be special. He's separating himself. Uppercut, it's wide open. Uppercut, baby. Come on. Keep moving. Keep moving. Good job. Good job, champ. Get together now. Take him out. And a well That's not what the fuck. By Sugar Ray Leonard. Tommy Hearns is... Oh, Teddy, this has got to drive his trainer crazy because he's leaving himself wide open with these sweeping shots. What are you talking about? Ain't nobody even got hit. What the fuck is uh, testing to a tongue? The horses are going to go out. Well, guess what? The punches, sooner or later, they're going to come in. Takes one but gives one. Good work. Oh my fuck. Ray Leonard. 90 seconds to go. Halfway through what? round eight. And now we got a fight. He fires back a right hand of his own. Leonard's combination punching is working well here. There's no need to be on the inside, champ. Come on. And he returns on that exchange. Hearns is so dangerous with that accuracy, a two-punch combination landing. Needs to improve that accuracy, miss with the I'm actually thankful for the fact that I can block the shit this nigga throwing. Ten seconds to go. They better game they better game me. Comes to an end. They better game me that. Hearns is really impressing us here tonight. That last round, boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. His opponent laid out some serious damage there. Yeah, I noticed that he's starting to land that uppercut a little bit. The only thing that I would be that's cool, that's cool. With what he did the last time, cool. I would just look for some confidence. Fuck no. More as sort of a good roadmap to maybe even get a knockout victory here. Put something on top of those uppercuts. You know the uppercuts landing. Now put something up top. That's a well-scored left hand by Tommy Hearns. 
Leonard showing that's you cool. that sublime skill right now with that two punch combo. Sugar Ray showing defense, able to block that punch. Sending shots to the midsection. That's right, I gotta spin this shit because this the end. Halfway through the ninth round, Turns has got Fuck something on. to think about now. He just threw a punch and had one coming right back at him. His opponent scored well with the counter. Damn, bro, do our president. Leonard blocks that punch. Jump on it, jump on it right now. Tommy Hearns is doing well here with that two punch combination. Why my stamina went down when I moved? He's tired. He's tired, champ. Come on, now's your chance. Oh my gosh. He had his eyes set on the uppercut, but was unable to land it. Final chance, last 10 seconds of round nine. Like, what the fuck did these guys be doing, yo? Really a lot of consistency from him with the right hand. Tommy Hearns has got to be careful not to fall prey to what so many fighters do. Close fight, you may be up, but you may not stay that way. He's getting some sound advice from his corner. I got, I got finish it. Final round has arrived. Like, what is he doing? more. Good work with the uppercuts. Nice job there. Very nice defensive guard there. Uh, you see how I, I'm pulling back fast enough to block some of that shit? I fuck with that a lot. Burns is throwing a lot of punches right here, but not a lot of them are landing. And that can be very discouraging to the guy who's throwing them because he's working, but he's starting to get a little frustrated, a little concerned that he's not doing damage, as you said. Basic boxing, and it works so well. Put your punches together. A good combo by Tommy Hearns. Just misses with that headshot. Damn. Last minute. I'm pressing shit and he's not doing the dog. He did a smart thing right there. Just created enough space and then landed the counter punch. Looked like the will of the wish. The old great Willie Pep. Made him miss, made him pay. Oh my fucking. I wish this nigga would do what I press consistently. That is Boxing 101. A nice, crisp combination by Tommy. Let me check out before I get dropped. Because when your stamina go low, you can get dropped. Keeping his hands up, getting way of his opponents. Who won? We Who won? Said it early on, stylistically with this Who won? Hardly a chance that we would go to the judges' scorecards, but Teddy, that's exactly what's about to happen. Yeah, it's early on, you're right. It looked like it was going to be an explosion, but fizzled out a little bit. Thank you. Thank you, yo. Burns' performance tonight was exactly what I can't stand fighting Nick Wright. And it's exactly what the judges were warned. He wasn't even nice, like, in terms of... I'm not going to say... He wasn't enough for me. In terms of, like, actual skill for the game, he wasn't good. Like, without him backing up. It was certain things here and there, but, like, he was doing too much. I don't like that shit. Your boy, Sonny G, the greatest one on you, feel me?